The classic graduation approach establishes the foundation of this double baseline cut. While working with the razor internally, releases weight and keeps the lines soft and fluid. After shampooing and conditioning, the hair is prepped with a cutting lotion to aid in taking clean partings. A horseshoe section is placed at mid-recession to just below the crown and secured cleanly out of the way. Starting at the side, a diagonal back section is taken from the horseshoe down to just in front of the ear. The section is combed T to the parting, elevated to 45 degrees, and cut parallel to the diagonal back parting. Diagonal back sections are continued using the same methodology. and cut using a traveling guide. Cross-check horizontally. The technique is repeated until all hair in front of the ear has been cut. Behind the ear, a diagonal back section runs parallel to the hairline down to the nape. Starting at the top of the section, the hair is combed T to its parting, elevated to 45 degrees, and cut using the guide to length already established. Thank you. 
The same technique is repeated to just beyond the center back. Key point. The hand position should consistently be lined up parallel with the section being cut. Starting at the front hairline on the opposite side, diagonal back sections are taken exactly as before. The hair is combed T to its parting, elevated to 45 degrees, and cut parallel to the parting. The balance is checked with the opposite side. Behind the ear, a diagonal back section is taken following the hairline down into the nape. It is combed T, elevated to 45 degrees, and cut parallel to the parting, exactly the same way as the previous side. Diagonal back sections are worked across the back of the head and the technique repeated until all remaining hair has been cut. Cross-check visually by combing the hair side to side. The completed section is now power dried from side to side. The perimeter is detailed with point cutting to add strength to the overall outline.
The weight line is detailed by elevating it horizontally in the comb and using deep parallel point cutting. Once again, the balance is checked before continuing. The horseshoe section is now released and moisture added to aid in the sectioning. The hair is combed back and pushed forward to establish the natural side parting. A new horseshoe, approximately one inch in depth, is placed horizontally from high recession on both sides. Starting in the center back, the hair is combed to natural fall and working in one inch panels, elevated to 45 degrees. The lengths are razored onto the guideline below. The technique is continued around the back of the head, the distribution remaining consistent at natural fall. From behind the ear forward, a disconnection is created by continuing the same length through to the front hairline, disregarding the shorter hair underneath. Key point, the shape of the disconnected guideline is square. Returning to center back, the same technique is worked on the opposite side. The balance is checked before continuing. Another horseshoe section is taken and the technique is repeated. The last remaining section is released and once again the technique is repeated until all remaining lengths have been cut to the guide.
A profile section is taken at the natural part. The section is elevated to 90 degrees and using the guide from the crown, layered through to the existing length at the front. Pivoting diagonal forward sections are over-directed to the profile guide, creating a soft inversion throughout the top. The technique is repeated on the opposite side of the natural parting. Returning to the center back, a pivoting radial section is taken from the crown to the occipital. Combing the section straight out, the tip of the razor's blade is used to gently dilute weight from within the section. Pivoting radial sections are worked around the head and the technique repeated. Key point. This technique is used only two-thirds of the way down the section. The shape is combed into place to check the visual balance. The hair is now dried. A large round brush is used to help smooth out the lengths. The shape is detailed further using deep parallel point cutting. Let's recap. Graduation. Partings and sections. Diagonal back. Distribution is T to the part. Elevation is 45 degrees. And the cut parallel to the part. Baseline. Partings and sections are horseshoe. Distribution is at natural fall. Elevation is at 45 degrees and the cut is parallel to the horseshoe. Layers. Partings and sections move from profile to pivoting diagonal forward. 
Distribution is 90 degrees to over-directed. Elevation is 90 degrees, and the cut is short to long. 